Hey guys, what's going on? Today I'm going to do another album review for a UK punk album. So, um, this is GBH's CG Baby's Attack by Rats. Um, so, uh, packaging, of course. So, here's the album cover. It's like an oil painting of, um, you see that you have like a straw right there and there's a bunch of rats all over it. Um, attacking a baby, literally. Um, originally I thought that was Heidel City Baby Attack by Rats was about like, like some like rich girl getting mugged or something, but yeah, so it's literally about an infant getting attacked by rodents. So yeah, or maybe it's just metaphorical. I don't know. So then you have like a like a light, the street lights right there, and yeah, so pretty interesting oil painting. It's all it's all right album cover. Ugh, the back album cover is pretty boring honestly because you have a blue background, and then there's there's pictures of the band like goofing around and stuff. And there's the track listing and credits and shit. So yeah. And then inside there's a put on dust sheet. So that's pretty cool because I like those. But we do wear out pretty quickly. So you have a giant GBH logo and then you have the lyrics to most of the songs. I think there's a few songs on that aren't included on lyrics. I'm not sure why. So anyways. The record is actually on a pretty nice looking blue vinyl. It's like translucent. So that's really cool. It looks really nice. So, yep, that's pretty cool. I really like color vinyl. Although, uh, lately it's been kind of hard to come across. Uh, it's, been, it's been a while since I've gotten a color vinyl. I think the last one I got was my TSOL um, Dance With Me one. Oh, no, 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 it wasn't. It was the Black Sabbath one. Okay, yeah, because I might go to the record store tomorrow. Because it's been a while since I've gotten anything. So, anyways, yeah. Um, so, no, music, of course. So, um, for side one, you have Time Bomb, Sick Boy, which is probably the band's most well-known song, War Dogs, Slut, Maniac, Gun Down, I Am Hunted. Side two, you have City Baby, Attack by Rats, The Prayer of a Realist, Passenger on the Menu, um, Heavy Discipline, Boston Babies, and Bell and Bop. Okay, so, um, side, uh, Time Bomb is really catchy, and it, it kind of opens up with, like, a clock ticking, which is kind of cool. Um, it has a pretty nice guitar riff, really explosive, really nice D-beat drums on here, kind of. Um, but not as good as Discharge is. Anyways, uh, Sick Boy is the band's most well-known song, and it's probably my favorite song on the whole album. I know it would be cliche, but it's really good, really catchy. Um, yeah, I really like the lyrics. But this whole album, in my opinion, GBH, um, their lyrics aren't as dark or interesting as Discharge is. Because their lyrics are mostly juvenile, but they're also really just like... Um, so, some of them are just kind of boring. I don't know. Um, War Dogs is okay. Sweat is pretty catchy. Um, Maniac is really good. Gun Down is good. I'm Hunted. That one's really good. I like the vocals on that. See, maybe Attack by Rats has a really annoying chorus, but it's it's like really it's still pretty catchy. The Prayer of a Realist is good. Passenger on the Menu. That one's actually really interesting. Um, that's a pretty good song. Heavy Discipline is good. Um, Boston Babies is alright. Bill and Bop is actually pretty good, but the lyrics are really bizarre. Um, it's basically just about a party, but it's an interesting song. So anyways, um, uh, like, this album, it's just, I don't know, like, I like it, but I don't love it, if you know what I mean. Like, like I like, I just prefer Discharge, honestly. Um, I like GBH, but I, I can never fully immerse myself in them. Um, I don't know, it's, it's like that with a lot of, uh, UK hardcore bands. Like, um, like the exploited, like, uh, I like them, like, I never, I don't love them, if you know what I mean, except for Discharge, which are, like, my favorite, you know, but honestly, uh, this is still a great album, though, um, if you're into UK hardcore, um, you'll definitely enjoy this, um, uh, the, the vocals, though, are actually pretty interesting, because, like, his voice is kind of, like, um, he sounds like a younger version of Kel Morris from Discharge, to be honest. Um, yeah, really, really, uh, like, just catchy, um, vocals. And the guitar, the guitar tone on this album is really good. It's, it's really, like, um, really thin and high-pitched. It's cool. And the drumming is really good. Um, you can't really hear the bass, but it doesn't really matter much, because it's just a punk album. Because, like, I don't know, like, the bass, in my opinion, for punk isn't really the most important thing. Um, it's mostly guitar and vocals that are most important in punk to me. But in UK Hardcore with like D-beat and stuff, the drums are also very important. So anyways, yeah, overall I'd say I'd give this album a 7 out of 10. But um, 
I'm not saying it's a bad album. I it's just never love this album, but I like it. Like, I don't know. Uh, it's okay. Like, um, this is considered to be the band's first really first full length album, but there was a release a release before this that I actually prefer over this, but I haven't found. I might get it some time, but I've never cared enough to. Um, frick, what was it called? Like the album covers black and white. Um, it was like. Uh, like acne studs, like acne studs, like leather bristles. I, for, I forgot. Uh, it's something along the lines of that. It's not like such a new, but I don't know. Like, yeah, I've seen that on white vinyl before, but I, I didn't get it. <clears throat> Cause I was, sorry, Cause I was looking for something else, but like, I don't know. This is pretty good. So, yeah. So, yeah, that's 7 out of 10. Yeah, this is a pretty short video. I don't know. I just don't have a lot to say about this album. Yeah, it's good, but it's not great. Um, the guitarists are very good. Um, I don't know, I just don't have a whole lot to say about this. So, but, yeah, overall, it's a, it's a pretty solid album. Um, if you're into UK hardcore. So, yep, that's it for today's video. Um, so don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.